hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to be showing you one of the best plugin that you can use in photoshop to retouch your pictures i've been using this plugin for some time and the result is amazing and let me just show you if i go to filter and go to retouch for me and you will see three of this plugin now if you check your own photoshop you are not going to see retouch for me down here you will have to download the retouch for me plugin and you have to create an account then once you download it then you install it and you'll be able to get this retouch for me here so at the ending of this video i'll be showing you a way that you can use to download it and you can use that way also to get a very big discount 20 percent discount when you pay for the plugin the plugin there are some that is free and there are some that is also paid So to start, I'm just going to have to create a new background, like I want to just create a new layer. So I'm just going to click, right click on this background layer and duplicate it and you will see background copy. You can rename the layer to any name you like and I'm just going to click OK. Or you can click on it and press Ctrl J on your keyboard. So once you press Ctrl J on your keyboard, it's just going to duplicate the layer below. So now to start showing you how this plugin works, I'm just going to go to filter and retouch for me. Then I'm just going to first click on retouch for me heal. So we want to use the retouch for me heal. What this one does is that it kind of remove the blemishes. It kind of fix pimples as in remove the blemishes, the unwanted scars, like the unwanted mark on the face. It will help you to fix the face for you as in the skin for you so let me just increase the size of this and let's look at the before and the after so if i click on the before you will see the blemishes is showing you will see that the face has many pimples but if i show you the after now you will see that the pimples has removed so this plugin has kind of automatically removed all those pimples for you without you stressing yourself so this is one of the better things and this is why I just love this plugin. It's very fast in removing blemishes from the face. Let's zoom in the picture again. Let me show you what's happening. This is the before and this is the after. So let's say for example, you don't want some of the blemishes to remove. You only want some parts of the blemishes to be removed as in you don't want all the pimples to be removed and you want to bring them back. There's also a way that you can bring them back. Let's go, for example, let me just go to eraser. So once you click on this eraser, it's just going to show this thing to you as in it's just going to show some kind of red and these lighter areas, these areas that look white are the blemishes that it has removed for you. So if you use this, your eraser tool and clean it, let's clean it. Let's just clean this area. You will see that the blemishes, the pimples has come back to the image. So I'm just going to clean this area with the eraser tool. Let's look at the original. You'll see that the pimples has come back. So if you click on this, your brush tool, you can kind of remove those pimples again. Once you use the brush and click on it, you can remove all those pimples again. And let's look at the original. The pimples has removed from the face, the blemishes and all the unwanted scars that you don't like. And once I'm done, I'm just going to click apply at this area. And you can see this is the before, this is the after. Let's zoom in the image so I'll show you. This is the before, this is the after. You can see that this our retouch for me heel has removed the blemishes, the unwanted scars, the pimples from the face. And this is why I love this plugin. So the next one I'll be showing you is the, let's go to filter, retouch for me is the, retouch for me dodge bone so once we click on this retouch for me dodge one you will see the results as you can see mine is loading so once the retouch for me dodge bone has load you can see the effect of this plugin let me just zoom in the picture let me expand this place and this is the original this is the result you can see this line area it has fixed some of these skin areas of our image 
the use of this retouch for me dodge bone is that it fix trouble skin areas such as bags under the eyes like skin bumpiness like veiny hands and veiny feet and it's also fixed on flattering shadows and highlights so that's the use of this retouch for me dodge bone now let's look at the before and the after again this is the before and this is the after if you look at these skin areas as in the areas you will see that it has fixed the skin for us and it has made the picture to look better so i'm just going to click on apply to apply it now let's look at the before and the after of all what we have done for the retouch for me heal and the retouch for me dodge bond is the before this is the after you see that our image is looking better so the last plugin that i'm going to be showing you is the retouch for me portrait volume if we go to filter retouch for me and go to retouch for me portrait volumes and we allow it to load just allow the progress to load and once it's done you will see that our image has changed let's look at the before and the after this is the before and this is the after you will see that our image now look more beautiful it add lightning to the lighter part of the image and it also kind of darken the dark part of the image for you don't forget the use of this portrait volume is that it add extra depth and dimension to portraits by lightening and darkening of different areas of the image and let's just increase this blend to 109 and if you see the before and the after you see that it did what i told you as in it's other lightening and darkening of the image and the image now look better than before so let's just reduce the blend to be 93 and apply it and this is the result of our image you can see the result this is the before and this is the after you can see that the three effects has applied on our image as in the three plugin the retouch for me heal the retouch for me dodge bone and the retouch for me portrait volume all the results has applied on the image and this is why i like this plugin and the plugin is very effective so like i promise you that at the ending of this tutorial i'm going to be showing you how you can get this retouch for me in your photoshop because your own photoshop will not have it if you go to filter and you will not be able to see retouch for me so in order to get this retouch for me plugin you have to go to your browser just click on your browser once you click on your browser you search for retouch for me as in you just type in retouch for me so once you type in retouch for me just hit enter on your keyboard and allow the browser to load so once it has load You'll be able to see plugins, you'll be able to see accounts, you'll see all plugins and the rest. You'll see different kind of plugins like Heal, Dodge Bone, Skin Max, Fabrics and the rest. Now you have to create an account. So after you create an account, click on the account section. Once you click on the account section, you'll be able to see different plugins as in different things. You'll see lots, you'll see Retouch For Me Heal, Retouch For Me Dodge Bone, you'll see I Bone Do you'll see skin max you'll see portrait volume you'll see clean backdrop you'll see retouch for me skin tune you'll see skin whitening you'll see frequency separation so this frequency separation is free and more of this plugin below are also free retouch for me photoshop panel and the rest you will see that some of them are free now for all these ones that are paid don't worry about the price you will get 20 percent discount if you use the promo code dirty studio or if you click the link in the description of this video under the video you will see the link under the video in the description so if you use the link you will get 20 percent discount a very big discount while you purchase this pack so you will see that i already purchased retouch for me heal and i already purchased retouch for me dodge and burn and i also purchased retouch for me portrait volume these are the three that are used in this video. So I will advise you as a photographer, if you want advanced retouching, as in if you want a better result for your image, you should use these plugins. You should use it and I promise you that the result is going to be nice. So after you purchase it, you can click on the plugin. Let's say for example, after I purchase Retouch For Me Heal, I will just click on this area. Just click on the Retouch For Me Heal and it will open this next windows or this next page for you so i forgot to tell you that the promo code in order to apply the promo code you have to visit the promo page the link will also be in the description of this video so you can be able to type the promo code dirty studio here just write 
Dirty Studio. And you'll be able to get a 20% discount. And there's also another link again that we apply in the description of this video that you can click and be able to get a discount. So let's go back now. I want to show you something on how you can download it. So if you click on that retouch for me heal or any of this plugin, if you click on the name, let's click on this retouch for me heal. Let me just click on it. So if you click on it, another new windows will show, another new page will show. You will see version for Windows, version for Mac. Now you should download the Windows version if you are using Windows. Or if you are using Mac, you can click on Mac. So for me, I am just going to click on version for Windows. And if you click on this version for Windows, you will see that it will just automatically start downloading. But I already downloaded it and I already installed it. So I am just going to cancel it. Let's say after you download it finish, an installation page is just going to show for you to install it or you can click on the plugin to install and if you are having problem installing this plugin let's say for example microsoft doesn't allow external app to install depending on the computer you are using you can go to google to search a way you, that you can allow your computer to download or to install external app then you can fix it and you'll be able to install it so after you install it you will go to filter you see retouch for me and you see that the plugin that you install is just going to be showing under retouch for me so you'll be able to click on it and the first thing you will see is a login page you will have to log in your retouch for me personal account in photoshop so once you just log in the account but your internet must be on so once you log in the account you don't need internet again to use this retouch for me after you log in because it needs login to be able to make sure that yes you have purchased it so after you log in you don't need internet again you can turn off your internet and you can be able to edit many type of pictures as in all your pictures without internet and we are done with this tutorial thank you for watching if this video was very helpful to you subscribe for more videos turn on notifications so youtube will notify you when i upload a new video and leave a like to help the channel out